I've done a lot of work like this where I'm not acting as the kid, which all, all these childlike drawings from the singing octopus to the singing trees, the singing, you know, everything singing, uh, I drew those. But, uh, but I often do these projects where I'm working with kids. You know, my experience is that kids are, are really visual. You know, especially these days, you know, kids are very visually adept. And so if you give them an opportunity to express themselves visually, they're going to do it. When I'm doing a, a piece of work collaboratively with kids, it takes a couple steps. The first step will be that we'll, we'll brainstorm together. So we'll get a lot of ideas. I'll have kids do their own drawings. And then we'll have a little bit of an editing process. Because I think part of the process is also then um, reflecting on what we've already created before we do a final product. I think this is helpful to get a better piece of artwork, but it's also helpful to, for kids to sort of see that their initial thought it, it doesn't have to be the ending point. And it's, um, I'll also add that when you're working as a group, it's neat to see then how one kid's idea and another kid's idea might lead to a, a, a third idea. And, and the collaborative process can happen. I, I think it, um, models all sorts of good things. I could go on and on about, about that piece of it.